Hello, Orange Room friends. As we get ready to go back into the classroom, I wanted to remind you of a few rules we'll need to follow when we get there. So first, we're going to read know and follow rules. I go to school with my friends. We have rules to help us know what to do. We have rules for play. And we have rules for work. Sometimes we work quietly. At other times, we speak up. Rules help us learn. One rule I know is to listen. I look at the person talking and think about what is said. If I want help, I can ask. I can follow directions too. I do things the first time I am told. Wow, they're good listeners. I also do my best. I think carefully at my work and I take my time to do it well. Look at her beautiful artwork. Rules help me show respect. I keep my hands and feet to myself. I won't use them to bother or hurt anyone. And I ask permission to use things that are not mine. May I please look at that? See, she acts very nicely to look at his book. Rules remind me to be polite. I say please, thank you, and excuse me. I speak kind words in a friendly voice. I do things to help someone else. Rules help make things fair for everyone. When I play games, I follow rules. I wait my turn, I let everyone use my things. And friends, I got us some bowling pins and a bowling ball so that we can play outside or maybe inside. If there is a problem, I listen and talk about it or I get help from a grown-up. See, so they ask their teacher just like you would ask me or Miss Grace. Rules help keep everyone safe too. I walk in the hallway, but should she be standing on the chair? I don't think so. That's not safe. Each place has its own rules. When I know and follow rules, things usually work out well. When I follow rules by myself, I am being responsible. I'm learning and staying safe. I'm showing respect. When we all know and follow rules, it helps us get along. The end. What do you think about that, friends? I think all of you are really good listeners and can follow rules. The next book we'll be reading is Germs Are Not For Sharing. What are too small to see? but can have the power to make you sick. Do you know, friends? Germs. See how small that germ is? They're in the air. They're on your body, in the food and water, and on all the things you touch. Not all germs are bad. Still, Germs are not for sharing because germs can make you sick. Achoo! Achoo! What do you need to do? Cover your nose with a tissue before the germs get out. Blow, wipe, and toss. Score! Straight into the trash can. <coughs> cough, cough, cough. What do you need to do? Cover your mouth before the germs get out. Like this, or like this, <coughs> or like this. If you cough or sneeze in your hands, hurry up and wash them because germs are not for sharing. When germs get on your hands, 
they can spread to other people. When you hold hands, when you play games, or even give each other high fives. Whenever you touch something, your germs can get left behind and you might even pick up some new ones. Here are some places where germs hang out. On the doorknobs and on the bowls we play with, so we have to make sure we wipe them. On our little cups at home, especially on the toilet and the bathroom, on our sneakers, our shoes are very dirty and even on the phone. We have to make sure that we constantly clean those things so that we don't get any germs. Germs, germs everywhere. What can you do? You can wash your hands. Use warm water and lots of soap. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Wash for as long as it takes to sing the ABCs or happy birthday two times. Wash under your nails and even your wrists. Now rinse, rinse, rinse. Send those germs down the drain. Bye bye germs. Ten good times to wash your hands before you eat, after you eat, after you sneeze, cough, or blow your nose, after rubbing your eyes, after picking your nose, after playing outside or with your pets, after counting your coins, after crying, after using the bathroom, and whenever you see that they're dirty. That's 10 good times to wash your hands, one for each finger. All clean. I hope you enjoyed those books, friends, and I hope that you remember to wash your hands and stay clean.